Hi, we've had humans in space for longer than six months. When they come home, you mentioned they recover their, uh, their range of motion, their motility, their ability to uh, restore function on, in, in a full gravity environment quickly. I'm wondering what the longer term astronauts, how long did it take them, those that have been, I forget the number, was it a cosmonaut that was like 11 months or 18 months out in outer space? Uh, Por Yoko. How long did it take take him to recover his full motion, and what kind of a program did he undergo to to restore his functionality on Earth? I saw Polyakov at uh, five years, and I think I think personally it took him about eighteen twenty years to recover completely. He was up there for fourteen months. All told, he had also been another four months up, so he had a total of 18 months in space, but continuously for 14 months. Um, I have no way of knowing how uh, unwell he was, but he just looked terrible. He looks great now. Um, I, I, we have had a lot of uh, astronauts up of all nationalities for six month periods. So we're beginning to accumulate a database. Uh, the data shows that recovery is slow for six months, probably of the order of about two years. And then we don't know if it's complete or not. What are you comparing it to? And some systems recover and they don't recover back to their original form. In other words, bone may be strong after two years of, of after the flight, but it architecturally doesn't look like the bone that you were left with because the, um, this, the pulling of on the bone of structures like tendons and ligaments and muscles that surround the bone are what determines the architecture of the bone. And unless you are uh, providing that kind of multifaceted stimulation, you're not going to produce a bone architecturally that is similar to the, the person's bone before they went to space. There are I, people I, here who know more about it than I do, so you can talk to Dr. Holden over there, uh, who probably has her own views, but that's my perspective.